In this video, I will show you how to add a thumbnail to your Roblox game. So let's jump straight into it. So in order to do this, as you can see, we're here on roblox.com. So first you wanna come across to Roblox and log into your account. Now, once you're logged in, you wanna come up to the top left-hand corner and click on to create. That's gonna take you across to your creator hub. And from here, you want to come to this menu on the left-hand side and click on to creations. So what you're gonna to want to do next is choose the game that you want to add a thumbnail for so I'm going to choose this test one here and what you want to do is just left click onto the game now from here you want to come to this menu again on the left hand side and click on to places once you get onto the screen you again want to click on to your game just down here and from here this is going to take you into the game settings now if you look to the left hand side you're going to see a different menu and you can see the option here for thumbnails so if you click onto thumbnails you can go ahead and add a thumbnail to your robots game so you can choose to add an image and the format needs to be JPEG, .dot .gif, PNG, TGA or BMP. You can add a video but that does cost 500 Robux or you can get a auto generated image which is again completely free. So to add an image what you can do is click onto the upload image button. Then what you can do is select your thumbnail that you want to use from your PC. So I'm just going to upload my logo. Once you've done that you're going to get a pop up like this. Just go ahead and click onto the blue submit button and as you can see we've gone ahead and we've added our thumbnail so once you've done that be sure to add a description to your thumbnails so they're accessible to everyone description should be concise and describe your thumbnails accurately enough to understand their context after doing this come down and click the blue save changes button at the bottom and what will happen if we come back to places what's going to happen is once that's been moderated by Roblox that's going to go ahead and add the thumbnail to your Roblox game. So with that being said I hope this tutorial did help you out today and if this did help you out I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.